What's up guys, AA Sport here, and we've got an exciting car today. An asteroid about the size of a refrigerator shot past Earth last week, and astronomers didn't know the object existed until hours after it was gone. It was a close call, from a cosmic perspective, the space rock's trajectory on October 24 carried it over Antarctica within 1,800 miles, 3,000 kilometers, of Earth closer than some satellites, making it the third closest asteroid to approach the planet without actually hitting it, CNET reported. Scientists were unaware of the object, dubbed Asteroid 2021 UA1, because it approached Earth's daytime side from the direction of the Sun, so the comparatively dim and small visitor went undetected until about four hours after passing by at its closest point, according to CNET. But with a diameter of just 6.6 .6 feet, 2 meters, UA-1 was too small to pose a threat. Even if it had struck Earth, most of its rocky body would have burned away in the atmosphere before it could hit the ground, CNET reported. Comets and asteroids that orbit within our cosmic neighborhood, approaching Earth within 1.3 astronomical units, 120.9 million miles, or 194.5 million kilometers, are known as near-Earth objects NEOs. According to NASA's Center for Near-Earth Object Studies CNEOS, NASA uses telescopes on the ground and in space to find and monitor NEOs, to track their orbits and identify their size, shape and composition, and to pinpoint potentially hazardous objects, managing these efforts through the agency's Planetary Defense Coordination Office. For an object to be considered dangerous, it has to measure at least 460 feet 140 meters, in diameter, NASA says. Ua the 1st of may not have been big enough to threaten the planet, but what about bigger asteroids that might be headed our way? NASA is also investigating defensive technologies for protecting Earth from possible collisions with larger space rocks, through deflection. The double asteroid redirection test, DART, scheduled to launch November 24, will test a method for diverting asteroids by hitting them with high-speed remote-controlled spaceships, NASA representatives said in a statement. Scientists will send the DART spacecraft hurtling into the near-Earth binary asteroid Didymos, which is shaped like a spinning top and has two bodies. The bigger one measures about 2,600 feet 780 meters, in diameter, and its smaller moonlet measures around 520 feet 160 meters, in diameter. Didymos came closest to Earth in 2003, skimming it at a distance of approximately 4.5 million miles 7.18 million kilometers, but it typically circles the Sun just outside Earth's orbital path, according to NASA. While Didymos doesn't threaten Earth, it's just about the right size to test if the collision can nudge a hazardous NEO enough to divert it from a collision course with Earth, according to the statement. Still, to divert an asteroid, NASA would need to detect it before it hit Earth. That's why another mission, NEO Surveyor, is developing an infrared space telescope that could improve the chances of spying sneaky asteroids such as UA-1 that approach from behind the Sun, according to the University of Arizona's Lunar and Planetary Laboratory, which is collaborating with NASA on the project. Thank you for watching this video. What's up guys, AA Sport here, and we've got an exciting car today.